Hey traders, welcome back. It's Kenya with BK Trading Academy. Let's hop into an analysis of GBP AUD. So currently we are seeing an impulse to the upside. This is a very easy and uh, recognizable setup here. You can see that we had a bullish flag pattern. Price has been trading in an uptrend. And this is our most recent low here. Before that, we were trading near the bottom of the flag. So you can see that after we broke above this support zone here continued higher. We came back, retested it, broke below it, and we thought that we'd possibly maybe get a breakdown because we had a potential head and shoulder. So here was our left shoulder, head, and right shoulder, and then we tested. We had a wick failure here right below the resistance here at 1.8980 or so, even below 89.38, and price continued higher. So after that happened, we said, okay, the bullish trend will likely continue. So now you can see that there is an important resistance ahead, and I don't know if price will actually get there, but now this is where we want to focus in the short term. So I believe that due to the price rising, we are going to see some type of bearish pressure come in here. So sellers will come in to overtake the, the buyers briefly. And since we had a breakout of this previous resistance here, this is where we'd want to clone this zone and then bring that down to this area, which was previous resistance, which will become our future support possibly. Now there's two things that could happen. Let's go out to the weekly. And now you can see from this weekly, Look how long we've been in an uptrend and look at the kind of struggle between buyers and sellers. So sellers have really pushed hard to push that price down and failed here right at 1.8862. Buyers came in, pushed it right back up. And now we have an important resistance where you can see no price action is above here. If we go out to the monthly, this is a very strong supply area. So at some point, I do believe selling pressure is going to come in, but the price has been going up quite a bit. We do have an inverted head and shoulder here on the monthly time frames, which you can see right here. And that pattern is just about to be completed. So I do think that we probably are going to push up just a bit as these three wick rejections on the monthly indicate that, but I do think some selling pressure is going to come in. So what you could be looking forward to right now is definitely a short opportunity if you are a counter trend trader. If not, you want to wait for a correction or a pullback back into previous support, which will be right at about 1.9156 or so. And you can monitor for a buy off of that area. So you can jump down to the eight hour and you'll see that this is your eight hour structure. So look here, you have an uptrend structure and you would want to see a pullback into that previous area there. So if you were shorting, this is where you'd want to take profit right before this turning point in the market. You probably also maybe want to take some profit right off the table there because you could get a bounce right there. But those are your turning points and where you'd want to focus. So keep that in mind. This is the resistance area you want to focus on. Like I said, I don't know if price will get to this resistance, but I definitely would not place my stop loss around this strong turning point in the market. I'd be planning either to wait for price to come here or if you were to short right now, I would plan on adding maybe more short if price were to rise another 50 pips or so if you're comfortable with that. So that is my analysis for GBP AUD. Comment below if you have any questions. Hope you guys enjoyed this analysis. Trade safe. Have a great weekend. And I will see you guys in the next trade idea. If you are new here, be sure to click follow on our profile. You will get these ideas delivered straight to your inbox. Also check out our Telegram below for more great stuff. We have some awesome resources and just so much great stuff for traders. So check it out and I'll see you guys in the next trade idea. Thanks for watching.